got to Corey at the Ostrich Festival in Chandler. That's a big event. Uh, I'm going to be out there tonight. Celeste's going to be out there with me. And you're out there this morning, bud. There's so much going Oh, and look behind him. Wait. Ostriches. Oh? Yeah. Morning, you guys, and welcome to the 31st annual Ostrich Festival. Love it. It's a bit on the uh, gray side today and a bit on the uh, breezy side as well. But this is going to be a great weekend. Uh, weather's going to be just fine uh, on the sunny side as well. And you know what the Ostrich Festival comes with? Ostriches. Yeah, that's right. Now, Ralph, I'm not sh Terry Kimball is with us. You're the president of the chamber. Is Ralph part of, of like a... He's a volunteer. He's okay. actually our Ostrich Festival chairperson. He is. You wouldn't know it by what he's doing there. He loves ostriches. He Can seems like tell? maybe a fresh air kid who grew up in the city and now he's out on the farm for the first time. You know what it. I mean? <laughs> <laughs> well, we love how Ralph loves the festival, and you too. And thanks to the chamber for uh, putting it on year after year. Can can you kind of tick off how the weekend will go? Just the high points, first of all, and Great. what can people expect when they get out here? Well, we start at two. We open at two o'clock today, and we have all kinds of live entertainment. Um, let's talk about the musical entertainment. Yeah, Low Rida tonight. We have Excellent. Commodores tomorrow, and award-winning Andy Grammer to, and Sunday. And we also have it's a all. Nice lineup. Yeah, we have the ostriches. We have a petting zoo. We have pig races. We have Big B, the transforming car. We also have the Guinness Book of World Records largest bounce house. Oh, wait, really? We the largest, do. officially sanctioned by the Guinness people. Of course. I love that. Well, look at this little doll. Um, you've got zebras. Yeah, hi, Gracie. Four months old, and She's then, yeah, and Gracie loves the camel, and the camel's name is Fiona. That's not. I love that they follow each other around. Uh, unlikely do. friends, perhaps. They are. They are very good. But we want to educate people and have them come out here and learn about the animals and how friendly. We don't want people to be afraid of animals. Well, certainly not zebras. Yeah. You can't keep these as pets, right? No, no. Oh, if only. You'd be the first on your block, uh, for sure. <laughs> well, Gracie and Fiona, thanks for sharing yourselves with us. Oh. And, oh, there we go. Uh, if you've never been to the Ostrich Festival, you really have to come. There, We've got petting zoos, you heard, pig races, largest bounce house in the world, Commodores, Andy Grammer, Flo Rida. It's going to be great, and it runs all weekend long. You won't want to miss it. More coming up all morning Any long guesses? from all your friends uh, in Chandler. We get in trouble. Where we are full of ostriches. Don't say that. Oh. So the Ostrich Festival, but Corey has managed to find his way into a bounce house. I think it may be the world's biggest bounce house. Is that right? It's one of them, at least. i got to see this. Core. Yeah. Morning, you guys, and welcome to the Big Bounce. Yeah, that's right. The world's biggest bounce house. It comes with the world's coolest operator. This is Dex, and congratulations. Apparently, Guinness has signed off on it. That makes it real. Tell me about this enormous thing. I'm going to get in there in a minute, but before I do, what am I in for? Well, I mean, it's really seeing is believing once you get inside. You can see the scale of it outside. It's 40 feet at its peaks. It's 100 foot by 100 foot, 10,000 square feet, a little bit over with some of the attachments. Certified Guinness Book of World Record winner, world's largest bounce castle. And now uh, once you get inside, you see we've got a gigantic slide in there. We've got an obstacle course. Uh, there's a panda bear. There's a fully functional DJ booth. We get some bubble machines and some <laughs> It's a dance party. It's a bounce house. I love that. you got a bubble machine too, eh? How many, uh, what's the capacity? Uh, we keep it at 200 just so that there's enough space for everybody to bounce nice. around and have some fun. And uh, is, is this um, all part of the festival entrance? Is there a separate uh, a charge to get in? Well, I guess we'll find out when we get here. Uh, but again, it's today, tomorrow, and Sunday. Thanks for bringing it along. We yeah. appreciate it. Uh, we love the world's uh, biggest anything. Whatever it is, if it's bigger than anything else in the universe, we're down with it. Now, i got to get in here with Brian. Oh, yeah. This is amazing. We've got a climbing wall. We've got, oh, i got to get over here. Brian, follow me. Oh, Troy. Oh, Renee, I wish you were in here with me. Uh, this is fantastic. I, I love these things. I grew up, 
I grew up with the world's smallest bounce houses at the carnivals where I used to live, and they always smelled like, like a combination of corn chips and feet. This is all different. It's out in the open air. Nothing can hurt you here. Oh, this is, this is the best. Ugh. Now, with 100,000 square feet of stuff to get through, I assume your kids will be worn out by the end of the experience. <laughs> this is not... I'm just about worn out now. Get the camera off me. It's humiliating. I've already, I'm already gassed. I've only been here for 90 seconds, but uh, this is just part of the fun. If you've never been to the Ostrich Festival, there's something Wait. new and cool every oh, year. Oh, come on, oh, one more. Oh, come, on, oh. <laughs> come on, you, you know, can do it. We wish we were there with you too, Corey. Oh, look at that flip. We got a guy who does flips. Show us your good stuff, brother. One. Is he going to do one more? Look two. out. What's going on? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, nailed it. Ladies, he's nice. available. Very nice. Nailed this it. This Rick Astley haircut. And you know, Look he's saying man. that uh, together it forever like and ever oh. to pass. What he was... Together forever oh. with two. Oh, Rick Astley. And don't you know I would move ahead. Never going right. to give you up. All right. So much going on at the Ostrich Festival. Yes. You, you got rides. Flow Rider. Flow Rider tonight. You've got uh, live music. You've got uh, food. And BMX. Then, BMX bikes with Court. Oh, no. I Corey. knew it. Now, seriously. I knew he'd be on a bike. You're, Mary's only got two weeks left at the station. You're going you're gonna to tarnish her last two weeks. Do it, Court. <laughs> Come on. I was yeah. impressed. You know, I travel with a whole pad of releases. I hand them out to everybody. Uh, so no danger of me injuring myself. But look, here you go, brother. It's Mike and Eric. Right. These guys are the BMX pros and... Wait till you see the stuff they do. It's insane. Are your mothers aware of what you're up to? She doesn't know I'm here. Probably not. She has an idea. <laughs> I don't want to lie. Now, when did, you, when did you get your first bike? Do you remember the day that you first learned to ride? Yeah, I remember. I was like 11 years old. Mm -hmm. and oh, wow. Yeah, like that was a while. Yeah. It, that now, was for, for this kind of riding, does your dad just like throw you down the street and say, good luck, son? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like well, that. you could be doing uh, anything as your job. This has to be one of the coolest ways to make a living. You guys obviously have fun. Yeah, I'm 21 years in doing this business. I've been doing this for a long time. Uh, this is what I love. Yeah. A lot of people, when I started, were like, really? Come on, Eric, get real. You can't do this forever. And now I'm the owner of the company, and I travel nationwide. We're the largest traveling stunt team. And we are here at the 32nd Ostrich Festival, and we're going to have some fun. Yeah, sure, you're in the are. happiness business for sure. Yeah. yeah. I bet you see a lot. Holy cow, look at this guy go. You must see on, especially these young people's uh, faces, little kids must really groove on what you're up to. Absolutely, and that's the thing we do. We do hundreds of school shows where we try to get kids on bikes, you know. Mm -hmm. So that's what we do. We well, love it. Now, I'm... <laughs> I grew up, like, you, go, you better grab it. I'm not even safe to hold it. Um, I grew up riding, like, a 10-speed with the gears torn off and terrible handlebars. But we still jumped everything. We just didn't land uh, very well. This is a pretty sophisticated bike. Tell yeah, me about it. This is a brand-new bike I just got. It's all chrome. It's pretty much bringing it back to the 90s. Uh, it's, it's a really good bike. Um, I'm sponsored by them, so I got it pretty much for free. Yeah. So, but and that's the key. We all we want to get sponsorships. <laughs> Am I right? How many guys are in your crew? Like when you're really rolling with the, the entire show, what are we going to be seeing? There is well, there's four people here. We have BMX and skateboarding. Our uh -huh. skateboarder is actually about to land, so he'll be here all weekend long. We have two two of the best uh, ramp riders, and I'll be directing everything through the mic. So it should be a really good show. Wow. And uh, as we wrap up, uh, what time are your shows? When can people come out? Oh, today is four six and eight mm -hmm. all right so don't miss it people come down check us out it's Very free cute. event oh i love that and um your skateboarders are they all part of the same act they'll be happening around this at the same time absolutely yeah they'll be on top of this big foot ramp right here behind me and they'll be doing a lot the guy that's here was the second person to do a 900 right after tony hawk this guy's a legend and he wow. watch out for him kind of amazing how once somebody does it 
then people say, well, I guess it can be done. Right. I, I might as well uh, give it a whirl as well. Wow, I can see uh, Mike up there. Is, uh, he's, he's gassed. Well, it's, it's not just, it's not gra all gravity, right? Exactly. You're actually working to do this. Yes, you pump your legs. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a good exercise, definitely. I mean, you, I, I run and I do other stuff just to stay in shape because yeah. you, you have to. Otherwise, you'll be winded. You'll be out well, of Thanks for sharing your skills with us. Appreciate it. Four, six, and eight tonight, all at the, gee whiz, at the 31st annual Ostrich Festival. Holy cow, look at the air. Crazy. Oh That's my amazing. gosh. Oh, this yeah. is the best. Whoa! That's what we're talking about. The first about. time you try that can't be good. Take a bow, how Michael. How many times he's done that well and, done, and crashed <laughs> before he lands like that? Well, that looked pretty tame. Yeah. That looked intentional. Wow. I think Corey really wanted to have I'm a shot at that. Did. Yeah. But can you imagine the first time you're like, yeah, I think I can do that. And your buddy's like, yeah, you can do that. The thing where you go up and you just spin, yeah, I got it. Uh, then you end up on one of those uh, YouTube reels. Yeah. Well, Corey's out at the Chandler Ostrich Festival. Mm-hmm. Hey, buddy. Morning again, you guys. Uh, look, we've got the Murcia brothers here. You see their faces? This is Alex. That's Anthony over there on the bike. Uh, Alex, obviously, go ahead and slam him in there. You must run the show because he looks like he's, is he younger than you? Yes. Okay. It's good to make your little brother do this, but you ride as well. This to me I th is one of the most impressive of all motorcycle acts. First of all, give us the name. Okay, so we have, what's curious, what's called the Globe of Death. Yes. And uh, Anthony and myself will be riding two motorcycles here at Victoria Circus at the Chandler Chamber Ostrich Fest. So it's something great for families to come out to see. And this isn't the only act in the show. We have many other thrill and circus acts as well. So you're telling me that both of you will eventually be riding in there at yeah. the same time. Yes, sir, that's correct. It doesn't seem like there's enough room for Anthony, let alone you as well. That's part of the excitement. It's all a show. We'll both now, be in there chasing each other upside down and everything. It's amazing. Now, is uh, is this a family act for you with your parents and grandparents? How long have you been in the business? The tenth generation. So my entire family is in the show business. And uh, starting my grandpa, we started riding in the Globe, and he's still riding to this day. He's 72. Oh, my gosh, that is great. Now, do you remember what he was riding when he started? What kind of bike was he on? I'm not sure, to be honest, but we've always ran the Honda CRF. So uh -huh. That's just our preference. Boy. Yeah. Well, I can't tell you how much we respect what you're doing, and uh, Anthony as well. What time are your shows? When can we bring people out? 3.30, 5.30, and 7.30 uh, today, opening day here at the Ostrich Fest. Boy, oh boy. Well, open that gate up. Let's get a look at this guy. The, these are not, these, come on out here, Anthony. These are not mere mortals. How, uh, do you remember what your first time around was like? It had to be about as scary as. I actually, I, I started out on a bicycle. Oh, yes. really? That's how you practice? Yes, we started riding out on a bicycle really low, someone spotting in the middle, and uh -huh. then just gradually work your way up a 50, 80, 100 bike until you can start riding on your own. Just a lot of practice and experience. Yeah. Well, Anthony, once you get your helmet off there, I've got one question that's burning in everyone's mind. How's this for getting girls? <laughs> well, it's it's pretty cool. I mean, uh, it works. It works. If you can't get a date doing this, then there's a real problem. All right, come out and see us. Uh, the Murcia brothers, uh, Alex and Anthony, man, they are going to make it happen for you. Always fun. There's something around every corner at the Ostrich Festival. Sponsored by Fox 10, by the way. Uh, that'll do it for the moment. More coming up in just a few. Yeah. It's yeah. a good way to go. You're on the bike. You look pretty cool. Right? And you're astride the bike. All the gear. Right there. Yeah, it's and kind everything. Of leaning against it. It's like, what's up? Yeah, it looks really chill. <laughs> you like that?